Being considered high class is a subjective term that can mean different things to different people. But there are certain traits and characteristics that are often associated with this label. These can range from the type of possessions you own to the way you carry yourself and interact with others. Hi there! Welcome to Luxio, the place where we motivate and inspire future billionaires like you. In this video, we'll talk about some of the things that are commonly considered to show that you are a high-class individual. Whether you are looking to improve your own image or just curious about the subject, this can be insightful and thought-provoking. Let's begin, shall we? Number 1. Coming from a legacy In Europe, the concept of being a legacy or having a heritage is highly valued and respected. This means that family history, cultural background, and long-standing traditions hold great significance and influence in society. It's not just about how much money a person has, but also about their ancestry and history. This value placed on heritage is often reflected in the way people interact with each other and in the decisions they make. For instance, in the realm of business, European companies that have a rich history and strong heritage are often seen as more reliable and trustworthy than new innovative companies. This is because heritage and legacy are seen as indicators of stability and longevity. But this does not mean that innovation is not valued in Europe. Both tradition and innovation have their place and are considered important. But heritage and legacy often carry more weight in decision making. Number 2. Assets Well, rich folks are usually pretty much set for life and don't need to work. They have enough money to cover everything they need. They may still work, but it's usually within their family's business empire. Being high class or having old money means someone's family has been wealthy for at least three generations. It's worth considering how amazing it would be to create wealth that lasts for generations. Just buy a few assets, pass them down to your kids, and make sure to take care of what you've got. As long as everyone does their part and avoids things like divorce, gambling, or reckless spending, even regular people can build wealth over time. Number 3. A level of sophistication that helps you spot posers. Should the rich people move differently than those who are truly wealthy, especially if they've had money for a while? You can usually tell by the little things, like their body language or expressions in response to different situations. High-class individuals are pretty good at spotting someone who's faking it since it takes one to know one. Although they may be social, they always have their guard up because they're always protecting their wealth. People with money aren't interested in taking someone else's. So, if you're wealthy, being around other rich people is great because they won't be trying to grab a piece of your wealth. Number 4. Showing elegance and sophistication without flaunting money Being classy isn't just about having loads of cash. It's all about attitude and how people see and treat you. If you've got class, you'll always find the money. But not everyone with money can say the same. Being classy is about being polite, gracious, and hospitable. Like paying attention to detail and taking care of your appearance. From your grooming to the clothes you wear and the scent you give off, it all comes together to show the world who you are and what you stand for. Number 5. How they interact with others When given the chance, most people try to make themselves look good. But high-class individuals do the opposite. They show an interest in others and make the other person feel important. They ask questions and are genuinely interested in learning about others because they love discovering new things. They treat everyone with kindness and respect because they know that gossip travels fast and everyone has a public reputation as well as a private one, which is often closer to the truth. If you're lucky enough to have people taking care of you, high-class individuals approach them with gratitude, not entitlement. Number 6. There's help on hand if you need it. For high-class individuals, they have folks to handle the little things like securing a table at a packed restaurant 
are planning their vacation, so everything's just to their liking. They also have people to make important connections for them. Their status opens doors to opportunities not available to the general public. They can even get preferential treatment or favorable terms on investments just because of their name. That's the perk of being high class. Number 7. Passion for Self-Improvement High-class individuals are always striving for self-improvement and personal growth. They understand the value of seeking out new knowledge and experiences. And they're always looking for ways to expand their horizons, whether they're attending events, networking, or being mentored by top performers. They're always looking for opportunities to learn and grow. Number 8. Managing One's Emotions Being high class means always keeping your cool and staying in control of your emotions even when things get tough. People with high emotional intelligence or EQ are masters of this. Even if they're feeling like a blazing inferno on the inside, they never let it show on their face. Losing control rarely leads to positive outcomes, so they keep their emotions in check. This helps them make connections and build trust with others, even if they're working with someone they don't like. In public, emotions are a tool they can use to get things done, like making people open their wallets at charity events. In other words, high-class individuals know how to use their emotions to their advantage. Number 9. Employees know them. When it comes to high-class individuals, they value building personal relationships with the people they come across in their daily lives. They're regular customers at certain restaurants, hotels, and businesses, and the staff knows them by name. This loyalty helps them to get better service because the people they do business with appreciate their ongoing relationship. If a long-time customer needs something done in a hurry, They'll do their best to make it happen because they know how important loyalty is. Essentially, treating people well and showing loyalty can lead to people taking care of you in return. Number 10. Posture and Demeanor High-class people have a certain presence that draws people to them. They are interesting and seem to shine just a little brighter than everyone else. It's all about the little things that make up their image and how it all comes together to create a consistent and cohesive perception over time. When you're high class, people know what you stand for and what values drive you because you're always consistent in who you are. Essentially, everyone we meet creates a version of us in their mind. But for high class individuals, most people carry the same version. And that only happens with time and consistency. Number 11. Knowing how to appreciate art. High-class people know their way around art, but a lot of the ultra-rich who don't really appreciate art still have huge collections. That's because art can not only add to your life, but also boost your wealth. In the past 25 years, art has actually performed better than other traditional investments like stocks, real estate, and gold with inflation making it harder for the average person to afford basic necessities and the economic turmoil affecting retirement plans, the ultra-rich aren't impacted the same way. Blue-chip art is a great way to protect and grow wealth during tough times. Number 12. They prioritize protecting their reputation above all else. When it comes to social status, your reputation is king. Having a good reputation and social status is so valuable and important. Your name should be worth more than anything you own. That's the power of your personal brand. People trust you and know you can deliver, even if it means taking a financial hit. High-class individuals will protect their reputation because money can always be earned back. But a tarnished reputation stays with you forever. No matter how much success or money you have, social status can't be bought. Number 13. Education Education is a big deal for those who are high class. It's not just about getting good grades in school. It's about knowing how to carry yourself around others and fit in with your peers. That's why the wealthy send their kids to fancy boarding schools, so they can be around other wealthy kids 
and wealth won't be a defining factor for them. For high-class individuals, it's not just about having a diploma, although that does help keep the family reputation intact. It's more about the sum of all their experiences and knowledge they've gained. They learn etiquette, how to be polite, and how to make connections with others. While others focus on memorizing facts, high-class individuals learn how to apply information to real life and stay informed about current events. They are masters of small talk and can put on a charming face when needed. Number 14. Money doesn't impress them and they don't find joy in spending it. Money loses its shine once you have it. Other people flashing their wealth doesn't really impress you anymore. There are different levels of wealth, like different size yachts or private jets, but it's not that big of a deal. When you're rich, you have access to top-notch services all the time, so there's no point in showing off. Posting a pic of your private jet is only to prove you've reached that level. But if everyone in your circle already flies private, then there's no one to impress. Blowing money doesn't bring joy because the excitement of spending money is only for those who don't have it. When you're wealthy, paying a ton of money for overpriced bottles at a club just seems like a waste. Number 15. Where someone is from and how much they enjoy trying new things. High-class folks love to travel and immerse themselves in different cultures. They're usually open to new experiences and have a taste for the unique. This gives them a unique perspective on the world and they often speak multiple languages. Traveling is not just about taking places off a list, but truly experiencing them like a local. They don't go for the typical tourist spots. They live like the locals, eating seasonal foods and seeing the geography and history up close. It's not about bragging rights, but it's easy to tell just how much of the world they've explored through their stories and experiences. And that's it. These are the things that show you are high class. Being high class isn't just about material possessions or what you do. It's also about how you carry yourself and treat others. Remember, true class comes from within. We hope you learned a lot from this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you're always updated with our latest videos. See you later!